The Detroit Lions training camp was pretty good. And Kenny Galladay is the future. This is Detroit Sports World. My name is Maurice Lewis. First things first, let me give a shout out to Anquan Bolden. He finally found a home. He signed with the Buffalo Bills on a one-year deal. Congrats to that man. Even though he was with us for only one year, he did a lot. He was practically our number one, number two receiver, and he led the receiving core in touchdowns. But back to Kenny Galladay. Kenny Galladay has had a really good training camp. Really good. And there's nothing but talk about him. He's been the main talk. He's been the main talk. A late third round pick. Granted, the Lions had a closer third round pick and they traded it to the Patriots, which is why we got that late third round pick. But we ended up getting two fourth round picks. But a lot of people said Kenny Galladay should have went in the fourth round. Well, let me tell you this, guys. He would have went in the fourth round, but he would have been a high fourth round pick. I mean, this guy has some tremendous upside. I mean, look at this. 6'4", 213 pounds, probably going to get bigger. He's only a rookie, and he's a red zone target. Red zone target. So watch out for this man. But you got guys like Ocho Cinco, Chad Johnson, visited the training camp, visited uh, the – I don't know why he was doing there, by the way. But this dude had nothing but good things to say about Kenny Galladay. He said, I am not a scout, but I know my – shit. Galladay is going to be special. Coming from a guy like Ocho Cinco, Chad Johnson, even though he's had problems off the field, he was still a top, probably a top five receiver in his prime. And coming from a guy like him who has the experience, done good things in the NFL, but didn't have that head screwed up right, it goes a long way. It goes a long way. So, I'm happy about what he said. I'm happy to see what this guy can do. I'm I'm looking forward to it. And our preseason game is this Sunday. Oh, my goodness. Football is finally here. Football is finally here. We play Sunday, August 13th against the Colts. So that should be a good game. Even though it's only preseason, guys, let's not get too excited or ahead of ourselves. But, you know, I look I, – I, I, I look – forward to what's to come with the Detroit Lions and that receiving core. It's going to be young. Matthew Stafford is working with a lot of pieces. Kenny Galladay has that third receiving spot locked in completely, completely. And he's a red zone target. Guys that may have an issue finding a spot or finding a home. I mean, who knows? We may even keep maybe one or two receivers after the third spot and that's it. But I mean, we may not see T.J. Jones. We may not see Jace Billingsley. We may not see Jared Abaderis, who's had a great um, camp, by the way. And we, we we may not see guys like undrafted Noel Thomas, you know. And then we and we picked up Keyshawn Martin um, in the offseason. Um, and he's supposed to be that guy for kick returns, punt returns, and stuff like that. So, you know, our receiving core is kind of tight, and we have a lot of talent there. But, um, you know, with the talent of names that I just named, we can only keep so many. So just be looking, guys. You know, there's, there's going to be some people that are pissed off when we, when, when we find out that, you know, the Lions had to cut a couple guys in order to make that roster. So I look forward to it. My name is Maurice Lewis. You can follow me on all social medias, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, you name it. Let me know what you think about Kenny Galladay. He is the future. Mark my words, he is the future. Have a good one.